Welcome back, Rounders. It's your boy, Poker Ringer here, aka Dusty Truth, Arm Poker Stars. I'm going to play today four tables of Zoom Poker on the $10 buy in tables. Um, my throat's crazy sore, so I'm just going to run four tables. I'm really not going to talk much. I'm just going to play, and you guys can just watch the video. Uh, let me know how you think in the comments. But like I said, I'm not really going to play talk much. Table one is top left, though. Table two is beside it. Top Table three, bottom left. Table four, bottom right. Just sit back, relax. Let me know how you think. My overall strategy is going to be aggressive in position, out of position, I'll slow it down. That's my overall strategy here, just at the lower limits. Pretty basic. Whenever I see someone that's up quite a bit of buy-ins, uh, chance they're a good player. They haven't left the table yet. They're doing good. I just put a yellow, yellow meaning warning for me that they might be good. And if I see them change change their play, then I can adjust their color. But you know, you never know when you see someone running that good if they're just good or lucky. I'm going to check raise, I think, on table one. Make them think I'm afraid of the diamonds. Wow, so it's flush on flush. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh, wow, do I lay that down there? Nice. Just thinking, why would he have diamonds on, on that flop and float? We had all the draws, unless he had 
Ace of Diamonds, Ace 10, sorry. Ace 8. But we had the 8 there, so. So already I'm going to change that to crazy player. Just all crazy means for me is aggressive. That was a really big pot for us. Like he just friggin' did not put us on diamonds by checking to him in that spot. I need to make these little buttons bigger. Fucking mouse can't get to them. I think he has an overpair here. I'm gonna put them all in, see if we can get them laid down. Booyah. I don't think he has an overpair after maybe how quick he folded, but. Pocket kings here, table one. All these people here, they're probably gonna think I'm just gonna try to steal this. We'll go high here and see what they think. I did it really high, just thinking it looks like I'm trying to steal all that money. Here's a guy. Courses are nice. Now a queen, go fuck yourself. Oh yeah. When you play four Zoom tables like this, you get about a thousand hands an hour is basically the speed I play at. Well, of course we're frozen when we get the queens, good times. Hmm. I'm gonna just call here to keep this guy in the hand and this guy. We're behind, we're behind. Call one here. All right, so we lose the kings and aces. Ace king here. I don't think ace king checks, so aces. Uh, we didn't lose as much as we could have there. Sevens, I didn't really pay attention to that friggin' hand.
Okay, we're deep stack, so I want to play again with this guy. We brick it, but... Table one there, that three bet I just did with the eight nine suited, the king come. Yes, was a shitty board for me, but it's not shitty for type of hands that would three bet. So uh, if he calls, obviously you shut it down, but you might get away with a lot of hands like that. All right, I was trying to use the ace as a scare card. I wouldn't be surprised if this guy's a four here in table three. Nice call on table two there, baby. Seven Jack. Good job, buddy. Let's label this guy a donkey down here. Raising us on the flop. Table four, there's no money there, but I might try to go $2 here. If they check it. Yeah, they just, I thought it was very weak there, so.
and see how short stacked that person was. I called table two there, he's so deep stacked that if we flopped the set there versus over pair, we maybe could have stacked him. I might have been sent a trap there in table four, but with the flush draw, it doesn't not too often they're gonna check there. Give you a free card.
Okay, I'm going to use that king as a scare card here. You might check raises here. But we three bet him pre-flop. Table four I'm talking about. Double C bet. Looks like he's going to call a raise though. And we'll just bow down. Huh, so a diamond draw miss though. So let's see if we can get away with one here. He didn't snap call. Is he gonna raise us? Nice, table four, baby. This spot here, guys. A lot of people wouldn't call here. Type by hand, you can usually with multi way, it's probably gonna call now. You can give people a lot of trouble. I feel like I could have pocket queens or something. Okay, queens would even aces would be in trouble. Watch this, you're gonna have pocket queens all day to Sunday. Ready? Table four, pocket queens, show it. Tens. Okay, we need an eight, maybe even a king or a queen. Maybe get the rest of the stack here. We do not get there. Chop it up. Table four. As you can see, guys, I like to see a lot of flops. I feel like we can outplay a lot of people post-flop and, uh, you know, turns and rivers and stuff. That's why I just want to get in flops, especially in position against a lot of these players. A lot of them are pretty weak. They have problems laying down good hands, so...
Pretty good flop here, table three. We got a big pot going to table four here. Five or seven diamonds. Fuck this, you have 10 jack now. Uh, both of them go all in here. Do I have to fold that, I guess? Ten nine. Ten is ten. Here we have two pair here. It's ace king of her bet though. Guess we'll check call table four. We have trip aces. Nice. What did he have? Queen 10. Booyah. I can't believe he didn't uh, bet that river. Really surprised with missing, missing that flush. He didn't go at it. Guys, let's hope he has a three here on table. Table two here. Shamus with a three, baby. Nine jack, go fuck yourself.
Okay, we've got a deep stack behind us here. Table two. Come on, buddy. Wake up with the kings and jam there. Oh. Big pot table one. Big bluff table three there, if anyone saw that. Okay, we're hoping for like queens or kings here. I don't know if I bet too hard there. Table one here, but I don't want to fuck around. We're deep stack. I have the ace of diamonds, so maybe I did battle out too hard there. Oh, there's a diamond. So I guess I check it, check call. We have the ace of diamonds, we're not going anywhere. So might be gonna jam here, yeah, we call him. Tens, hold. There we go, huge pot there. That was big there in table one there. Look at this, 33 buy-ins right there. I guess he's only risking. Wow, let's see what this guy goes all in for. Aces, just jams aces. So we're gonna have to make a, you should make a note on that. I don't really have time running this many tables, but Dirk just jams with aces. Dirk. How long's the video, guys? I'll still grind for a little more. I haven't made a video in a bit. Check call table one. flat with my queens here mix it up here take a different line see what under the gun razor is going to do here so we got a lot of people in the pot there Ooh, looks like i should have raised i think it's not the best board here with all these people i'm gonna call 
and Jack, a queen gets on there, but. Ooh, five actually helps us. If someone doesn't have a set here and they had nine eight, this guy here could have a hand. We protect our hand a little bit. I'm nervous what this guy does. If he raises, I probably have to bow here. He could have the six seven. I don't think he raises with the full house. Okay, we want a queen, ten. I think I'm just gonna check it. Is that too nitty? Six, seven would have had us the whole way. What calls us here? 10 jack got there, like a pair. So just gonna go all in. Man, what hands call us? I don't know, I might have, if he raises us, sucks. Does he ever check a full house there? I bet Casey had 10 jack. Let's see if we can get a 10 to call us. Even ace nine. 10 jack's gonna call us. Let's look at this hand down here. Wanna see the 10 jack? Show us the 10 jack. The jacks, oh wow. Let's give him this for not raising pre like that. All right, we got a big flush draw against uh, another deep guy up here called the pretty big three bet. Ooh, we got trip queens here. Raises your trip sevens and missed fourteen dollars. Okay, we got a full house here. I'm just gonna bet with my full house from table three. Build that pot. All right, we got the flush down here. Could have ace. I don't think this ace high diamond draw checks that flop versus all these people. I think we're good. Why would he check the diamond draw on the flop? We block queen 10. This is three betting hand free. This guy's causing us a lot of problems up here. Wow, this guy's so short stacked there. I'm going after the bigger guy. Eight, seven. When the diamonds get there. Uh, kind of aggressive here in table two. start sitting out guys and make that a video let's see what happens here on table two here this guy looks like he was pondering something pretty big not a horrible hand to do that with we'll check it cut some of that this guy might bet here Queen kings are gonna bet there it won't put us on a 10 we're calling that Go check, check. 
Oh, check, check. Check, check. Wow. Do we call here? Is he bluffing the two people? Check it. Check it. Queens. Oh, wow. Oh, we got a little aggressive there and it cost us a bit there. We'll open up a chest for you guys and we'll end the video. Pretty good session. All right. <clears throat> so once again, I apologize for my voice. Like I said, I'm losing it. Oh, it takes a long time to open up this freaking chest. All right. A whopping six coins. Nice. All right, guys, I'm going to end the video like that. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.